Would you like to wear color changing clothes? Check out. Hi. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this new every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up at the Paris Fashion Week. Kunihiko Morinaga showed his latest update featured new photochromic hardware and was the first time he had integrated the technology into faux fur, velvet, lace, knits, jackets, and satins. Pairs of models came out on stage wearing adjacent but not identical garments that were often cut symmetrically to look the same from the front as behind or to have what you would expect the back to look like in front. Two UV emitting tubes were lowered in front of the models to the slow build of Ravel's Bolero. As the light passed in front of the garments, their color transformed from mostly white into vivid tones and patterns, including an enrelage monogram and polka dots. The models then turned 180 degrees and were zhed again. According to Morinaga the clothes also react to the UV and sunlight, and the reaction is specific to the particular weather conditions to which they are exposed. There was a deeper environmental point waiting to be exposed by this line of consideration. News Source, Vogue Social media app Snapchat launched its own chatbot called MyAI, using the latest version of OpenAI's rapidly growing generative text tool, ChatGPT. MyAI is a custom chatbot that for now is only available to Snapchat users, who pay $3.99 per month to access exclusive, experimental, and pre-release features. Chat about your day or write a haiku about your bestie, Snapchat said in a demo of MyAI. My AI can also recommend birthday presents for friends, help users plan weekend trips, and suggest dinner recipes, Snapchat said in a press release announcing the new feature. News source CBS News, Goldwyn's Influx redefined zero-waste fashion with Syngrid. Japanese sportswear manufacturing company Goldwyn has partnered with Synflux, a speculative fashion laboratory, to develop an algorithmic system aiming for zero fabric waste. Dubbed Syngrid, the collaboration makes use of Synflux's proprietary technology, Algorithmic Couture, that minimizes textile waste being discarded during clothing production by one-third. According to Synflux CEO Kazuya Kawasaki, the software is a mashup of machine learning and 3D technology. It analyzes the 3D data of the clothes that we want to design and suggests the way of manufacturing with the least waste while also maintaining the sportswear's original functionality, comfort, beauty, and so on. News source, Design Boom, ever since the ChatGPT integration into Bing, Microsoft has been all over the headlines. Seeing the results, Microsoft is planning to integrate AI into all of its areas, including video games. According to Semaphore, Microsoft has developed an AI that is capable of playing their famous video game, Minecraft, all of its own. Unlike inputting actual commands and moving the avatar using the keyboard, an AI will act of its own free will when natural language commands are given. You only need to give commands like building a car or castle in AI Minecraft, where they complete the task independently. Generative AI is essentially used here for building objects rather than a player manually building objects. News source, India, AI as interest in Web3 grows day by day, the number of emerging brands developing next-generation digital fashion is increasing. Among them, Medical Wai, a Web3 brand from Japan, is developing 3D avatar NFTs by crossing the digital and physical worlds. Such Medical Y announced in December 2022 that it will sell not only NFTs but also apparel items linked to avatars. Rin Yoshida is used as a model, and sweatshirts and hoodies are sold on the EC site 60%, which is popular among Generation Z. Once purchased, the avatar can also wear the same clothes. News source, Zozo Next, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items check out our new podcast 360 fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.